All right, so here we are again with the 2023 Sea Hunt Ultra 305 SE, and I'll show you what I did on it. So, first things first, it does have a JL uh, Media Master 50 uh, that comes from Sea Hunt from the fact, um, factory installed. As I showed you earlier, it did have six and a halfs in the front and um, six and a half on the sides. Well, we change those out to a set of M677s, as you can see here, and then it's M677 up here as well. Now, we didn't just get rid of the M, uh, M3 six and a halfs, went ahead and put a set up here in the front, and went ahead and took the other set and moved them back here to the rear. Now, we also did add subs in here. We added two M6 10s. There's one right there. And there's another right there. Now powering this whole system is an 808 and a 601. And those are down here in the cubby. Give me a second to get down here. This is a little sneak peek I showed you the other day. And here's your amps. So if you look, they're fit inside the cubby nice clean everything fully accessible still gets all the batteries has breakers on it in case there's any issues you don't have to worry about replacing fuses uh, all behind the panel real nice real clean out of sight out of mind so yeah and she rocks she is pretty darn loud so this customer is going to be extremely happy with his vessel so again, we used a JL Media Master 50 that came pre-installed from Sea Hunt. Took the factory installed six and a halfs that were M3 six and a halfs out of the front and the sides. Replaced those with JL M677s. Installed M610s. And then, like I said, moved those six and a halfs to the front of the boat. And moved the other set to the rear. So, yeah, on to the next one.